proprio non si mai dopo cento. <laughs> yeah, the camera's so far away. Yeah. <laughs> Good morning, YouTube. Welcome back to another daily scuttlebutt with Ivy Family Factotum. And I'm Anson. And I'm Gladys. And Willow just took off. Where are you going? <laughs> yeah, she was sitting on the couch because. But now we're well, recording, you want to take off? It's her couch, and Dad's on it, so she doesn't get the full spread, spread out. There but you go. There she is. I know, we oh cut her my. hair. I cut her hair. But um, what do we have for today, babe? What are you going to be doing um, today, huh? Taking over the world. Mm. So, taking over the world, huh? We did bring the washer and dryer here. Yeah. Yeah, we did do that. Well, there, there is one thing that's up in the air. Um, actually, that's something that we're not necessarily going to talk about that. But we might be going to someone else's property to pick up some supplies. Yeah. Um, mm -hmm. I'll leave it at that. So, yep, just waiting. We'll see. Yeah, because it's, <laughs> well, it, that's for today. It, it's definitely going to happen this week, but that's just, because mm -hmm. he, he's a little busy today, so it might have to happen tomorrow. Yep. So, we'll, we'll see. Yeah. Yep, we'll play it by ear, see what's going on. It's Monday. People have a Monday. lot of stuff to do on Monday. Um, it's a little... Yeah. I don't know. It's a little funny outside right now, or yeah, it was a, a little I'm, gloomy. I know the weather showed that you know we have possibility of rain all week. Uh, <laughs> yeah, it, it is what it is. Yeah. There's um, projects that I can still be doing in the laundry room. So even if it's raining, yep, you'll be under the tent. Technically inside, <laughs> even though it's just yeah. a, a carport. Type. So my washer is hooked up. Yep, washer's ready to go. It's just my dryer that needs to be. Yes. So, I it, the plug that's on there currently is a four-prong. It's a four-pronged plug. Mm -hmm. The outlet that's on the, the RV pole is a three-pronged 30-amp, which is an RV plug. Right? So, that, that is different than the... <laughs> than the other one, yeah. other one. And, Willie, you're getting <laughs> on my microphone, kiddo. <laughs> She wants to be a part yeah. of it, yeah. So, I'm going to have to go and look and see uh, for the, the cord, if I can get the RV style plug that would connect to the dryer. Mm -hmm. uh, if not, I'm going to have to replace the outlet for the dryer. Yeah. Mm -hmm. to, to change it from an RV. Because I want it to stay an RV plug. Um in the event that you know we reutilize that and we will reutilize yes. that later for an RV setup. So mm -hmm. even if I have to take that plug out, I can I can hold on and keep that plug and then just go get a three prong um, outlet for the dryer because mm -hmm. um, it's the ground is different. So um, the RV the ground is a round like a round socket. And for the dryer ground, it's like a an L shape. So it's just it's a little different. That's all. Yep. So for now, uh, no washing clothes until that gets yep. taken care of. Especially so, if it's gonna rain all day, I can't. I mean, unless you wanted to, outside. I can always put up a clothesline. That's what I was gonna say. I oh. said I can't do that because it's gonna rain all week. They say it's gonna rain. Well, you could put I the clothesline inside the tent. No, you cannot do that. Does he understand how drying works? You have it inside the tent. You're not going to let it dry. There's no wind it'll just for take, it. It'll take it's a lot take longer. take forever. No, I'm not doing that. You'd have to leave the door open. Yeah. All the critters, especially the little birds that like to make nests. Yeah. Yeah, that like to make net Birds that like to make nests inside the boxes or anything that's empty. Uh, <laughs> Yeah, they even got into the other tent when it was closed. Yeah. So they're going, because the, the back side of the tent is still, like, open, just a hair. Like, barely, barely any, mm -hmm. but they they get in there that way. Mm -hmm. Or just, like, a little tiny sliver of a gap that's on the front door. As long as they're birds and not rats, that'd be good. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I mean, since we've taken care of the shop, you know, and all that, that stuff... I have not seen any other rats. No. But that's not to say that 
Because we still got a big pile of junk yes. where the house used to be. So, so that's going to be fun when that gets all removed. Yeah. And uh, Which, yeah. I mean, most of the stuff in there is just metal and rubble. I mean, I know that yeah. there's still a little bit of, you know, debris and trash that's going to have to get hauled off. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, I know people cause... say, dig a hole, <laughs> put it away. Oh, God, I just, uh, no, I don't, I don't want yeah. to dig a hole. And if if we had a dollar for every time someone said that. I mean. I mean, I, I don't have like yes. ten, 10 bucks, but. Still. That's why, I mean, that's why the water. A lot of people, though. That's why the water here is very uh, metallic-y and very, it smells like eggs and everything. And that's why the doc was like, yeah, get a tetanus shot because the soil is just, you know, it is what it is. Because people yeah. out, out here practice the, let's dig a hole and dump everything in there so you're essentially putting all that yeah all, all the it. the toxics all of the you know, the plastics the metal the the trash there's i mean i understand you know that's what a landfill is doing mm -hmm. but yeah. a landfill is a designated space yeah for that that's going to be away from waterway normally away from waterways yeah but I, uh, I, I know the ones in virginia were not no <laughs> they were like right next to the river yeah, I just don't want to um, do that. I don't, I don't want to dig anything in there because then later yeah, on I know I'm going to go back and I'm going to like plant trees or something and then your tree is growing and then, oh, look, there goes a bike or, <laughs> or, uh, or something. Yeah. And you're like, I'm, I'm like, not. Yeah, like where did that piece of shard yeah. come from? It was over. Okay, and we're back. So yeah. speaking of the, the person, well, it doesn't want to move. Yeah. She took over my seat. Yeah. <laughs> so speaking of the person that we're going to be going to visit this week, actually called. <laughs> so it kicked us out of the the recording. Yeah, he had a long conversation with him. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Which I always enjoy. Yes, definitely. So. And now he's stuffing his face. Now I'm stuffing my face. So we were talking about being good stewards of our land and not wanting to bury trash and and having shards and, and metal bikes and stuff growing out of trees. Yeah, we did. <laughs> we did. We did talk about that. I just, you know, I know that I want to keep this thing for as long as I can and hope, you know, that it stays in our family forever. And I don't want, you know, mm -hmm. us having to dig up and or build stuff mm, and then have you. to dig things and then you find trash. Um, but, yeah. But we'll burn. We'll burn at every bread. chance Thank we you. can. If we have trash we'll, that can be burned, we'll burn it. Yeah. If we have metal, we'll recycle it. Yeah. Um, concrete. Uh, I mean, the concrete, I'm okay with digging, I want to say. Uh, well, a lot but, of the concrete stuff, you know, if it's stuff that's <laughs> able to be broke up. Yeah. Like, obviously, the, the big slab that's over there. Mm-hmm. Um, is uh, obviously allowing us to get the power once we get a power pole yes. set in place that we don't have to pay for that. Mm -hmm. uh, but that's also something that that can always be broken up into like riprap mm -hmm. to be used around, you know, the, the property for water management. Yeah. And, uh, and different things. So, Reutilizing it. Repurpose. Yeah, yeah, if we're able to, to break that up, you know, we can always move that around. So mm -hmm. I'm not worried about concrete. Yeah. So that's yeah. what we'll be doing. That's our mindset on trash. Yeah. <laughs> Everybody has their mm -hmm. um, their way of getting rid of it. Mm -hmm. We just prefer this way. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah. So what else do you have planned? Other than I have to go into town. I have to take the other kiddo to get her glasses. Uh, I was just going to continue working in the laundry room. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'll probably come back and chop some mm -hmm. trees down. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and then in two days I get to see my OBGYN. So she can give me the clear, or I mean he can give me the clear because I'm done not being able to carry Oh, I'm ready. Heavy. <laughs> Jeez Louise. I'm ready. Stop. Yeah. But yeah, so there's that. What else, Willow? What do we got going on other than... What do you got going on, Willow? 
you being a flea bag and your dad being one too with his chiggers and everything. <sighs> Man, bugs are killing me. <sighs> yeah. I, I don't know. That was probably when I was cutting grass. I don't know. You I got, got some chiggers or something. You just want my cheese bread? But yeah. Yeah, he wants. Mm. she wants a cheese bread. So, I guess that's everything for right now. Yeah. Um, right now, that's what we got going on until the parents get here, too. And they'll be staying here helping us, you know. Yeah, because they're, they're going to be staying. So, last time they were only here for, what, a week? About a week. About a week. Yeah. So, so this is going to be a longer stay. It's going to yeah, be fun. Kicking, her, kicking Willow out of her bed and turning mm -hmm. that one into a, yep, a big bed. This, this couch is going to be the one turning into the bed. Yeah. And she's not going to like mean, it. There's other choices. I can put mom and dad into the girls' room and move Anaya into um, the bed out here. Yeah. But I don't know. We'll I'll figure it out when it's time because I don't think mom and dad would want to sleep with the pain <laughs> of our child that wakes up at 6 in the morning. Yeah. Every day. That's why I don't know. Maybe I should put an Anaya out here. She wakes up early and the other ones wake up late. We'll so, we'll see. I mean, her bed turns also into a big old um, two-sleeper. Yeah. So, we shall see. We shall see. We shall well, yeah, see. Yeah, that's all I got. Yep. I got plenty of projects to work on. Mm -hmm. Stuff in the blacksmith shop, stuff on a bridge, stuff yeah. in the laundry room. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm a little bit everywhere. We, we still got videos in queue. We still got laundry room videos going to be coming out. Mm -hmm. We do have a bridge video coming out today. Yep. Um, mm -hmm. Yeah. Then we got some other work. <laughs> Just uh, make sure that you, know, you got your notifications turned on over on the main channel. And this channel is definitely great, greatly appreciated. Future fun products. Yeah. Products. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Things coming soon. Yeah. If you're here, <laughs> you know, for the... Uh, Projects. <laughs> If you're here for the first time and you're not subscribed, go ahead and click that subscribe. It's greatly yeah. appreciated. Mm -hmm. And just know that this is our side channel to the main channel, Ivy's Family Factotum. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, so you can go over there and subscribe as well. Yeah. Just do a lot more chatting here. Yeah. Mm -hmm. This is just strictly daily vlog, Monday through Friday. Yeah. Inside and then outside. So. Yeah. yeah. But that's all we got. So that's last all. but not least. Always thank a veteran. Every chance you get. Not only on Veterans Day. <laughs> we'll see you on the next one. Bye. Later, y'all. <laughs> now you gotta get it turned off. Oh, God. <laughs> I know why. I turned it off last time. <laughs>